Hello there everyone and welcome back to the, the All Bonuses Super America Mod for Hearts of Iron Forum host Mr. Dougie MacArthur -y -lo Lover, but we're securing Asia right now, apparently. Which, if we can do well enough with them, we can just go ahead and launch from a satellite state, one of these satellite nations, into somewhere else. But the colonial nations in Europe seem either unwilling or unable to effectively defend their Asian colonies. We must take over this burden for them, lest these areas become springboards of further aggression. So there's that. Strategic interests. Uh, Benelux Beachhead, secure Iberia. We might want to do that one next. Iberia should prove an excellent staging ground for military operation uh, into the rest of Europe. But the uh, recent civil war is a perfect excuse for military intervention, and Burma stands defiant, unfortunately. And the Dutch rock out. Everyone's defiant. God dang it. A message derived from the Burmese, the Siam, and Dutch government. Freedom once won must never be relinquished. No further communications have been received, and Ambassador in Burma has been handled, handed his report, or passport. Well, alright. Still want to go to war with Colombia for some reason. Not sure why. But, uh, got a couple days until we do that. So that sucks, we can't go to Europe. So instead, let's see if we can get to at least National Spain. Because we can do that, we'll join the war um, against the Axis, maybe. And kind of go from there, because the Germans are destroying Belgium. We've got some comms to go through, they're destroying the Dutch. And the common turn and, well, the Axis are going to be sloshing each other as much as and as hard as possible. So, uh, in the meantime, we could probably use a little bit more, uh, well, something else. Let's get a partial mobilization, shall we? We can start building some stuff here. 3940, which is not ideal, but, you know, whatever. And what do we want? Anything here, really? Not too much, you know. It's a little ahead of time. 2040, there we go. So now we should be able to make some real good stuff. And there go those guys. Have fun. Kill each other off as much as you possibly can. Then they join the Axis, and now they're fighting each other. Not bad. Netherlands have joined the common turn, whatever. And the Japanese Shogun has joined the Axis. So, all right, there go the Dutch boys. Belgium's holding out though. Brussels, oh, ah, it's just fallen. As soon as just joined them too. Let's see what happens. The Polish are actually pushing out a little bit. Getting pushed in a little bit too, but whatever. But after securing Iberia, Black Chamber operations, Great Britain, war with France, good. Uh, French Commune, one China, oh, under America. The Chinese are in a constant state of civil war. As they seemingly cannot unify themselves, we'll do for them under our rule. Portugal refuses. Antonio de Oliveira Salazar has reacted with deep consternation to our diplomatic note, however. Uh, he adds that Portugal has a long and proud history of independence, and sovereignty will never permit a foreign power to enforce its will on them. He further implored President Douglas MacArthur to consider the ramifications of war on this issue, which would surely see the U.S. labeled the largest threat to peace and would have unimaginable consequences. The governor Francisco Franco, though, this is a smart guy, has agreed to our request and will allow our ambassador to veto on any major policy decision they make. A wise choice. Very wise. Are you naval invading? You kind of are, yeah. I take you guys. You're in Portugal. Very nice. I guess we got somebody who wants us to go there. Ah, screw it, just do that anyways. Um, close out of that one. Intervention mandates. Foreign influence. Don't really care. Can't build any radar though, which kind of sucks. Actually, it really sucks. Ship Wilds, how are we doing? Doing alright? Ready to invade? Uh, who else? Burma. It's just, yeah, these guys. Makes sense. In the meantime, we'll only need quite a few more divisions. Let's go 30. Or 29. Good enough for now. You guys, um, sure, why not right here? I'll take these guys out and then we'll go to war with the Axis. Once they start pushing really into the comment and a whole bunch, they're still not dead yet for some reason. Um, they don't push really hard. I guess our goal is to try to get Great Britain at the very least. Because we have National Spain under us for now, but still. Uh, so. So, so else, another comment was, Doug got Doug when full star ship troopers on us. So it says, can you do Equestria War as Zarantia? You don't play Equestria War often. That's true. So it says, can you do uh, the Republic of China in the Cold War mod? Yeah, probably eventually. So, I just keep pestering me about it and I will do it eventually. There's this pressure, second Ljubljana award, Macedonia's here. Interesting. Oh, wait. Are you communist? Oh. Well, I wasn't expecting that. Then again, I wasn't expecting uh, Spain to join us, but whatever. Here we are. Let's go with that one. And what do we have here? There's priority, yes, please. La Libertad, very good. To God, we can do okay here. And ship stuff. Super heavies. Let's just go with the normal heavy. 
go. And we immediately start losing. Not ideal, I would have to say so. Gene Chen and Defiant. Uh, yeah. Well. Oh, Lee Zong Gren accepts! Look at that! Beautiful. Oh, that's, that's what I'll do. Following extensive negotiations and guarantees on his personal safety, Lee Zong Gren has accepted to allow our special envoy extensive consultation rights, allowing us a significant amount of influence over the internal matters. Excellent. And you know, doesn't care to, to bet, Sin Kyung. Chiang Kai shek accepts too! Warp on purple? South America has always been an unstable re region. Should be prepared for to take action there. Are we at war with Japan then? No, just these guys. That's what I thought. Greater American hegemony. Oh crap. They're on the axis over there. Oh god, we're going to be in a two-front war, aren't we? You can probably push pretty quickly through here. China can defend itself for a little bit first. Um, rockets are nice. Are there artillery? Sure, why not? Did we... Actually, we didn't. Oh, look at that. So you guys are going to be done with that. You hold. You give up territory right there. Small bit. Not too much. And you guys all are going to come right uh, here. Nice. And there we go. That's all you really need to do. Six divisions, huh? Let him get in here. And then we're going to go to war with these guys, too. We're definitely going to need more planes. And probably more rubber. Yeah, my god, do we need some serious military factories, don't we? Yeah. Throw on at least one more. There we go. Let them space themselves out a little bit, and then you guys can go in too. Very nice. Rework conditions, we could. Those operations, not super necessary. Go to volunteer only because I know we're going to need that. China, don't worry about it. I have a feeling we'll be more than fine. Nice. We're playing purple, we're playing green, defense the Pacific. The giant awakes, Confederate war heroes, equipment capture ratio is pretty good. Um, Directed at the banking sector. Following the correction of the financial markets, that is perfectly normal in the economic cycle. Previous governments have instituted quite unreasonable constraints on financial activity. But no doubt, well intentioned, these restrictions clearly do more harm than good. Ah! Oh, crap. Hold on here. Come on, give us god dang Portugal. What the heck? This makes no sense. But we should plan for a war against Port uh, Axis eventually, too. Just give us a territory. You don't need it. Oh, well. Sunrise is no more. There we go. Hurry up, get your Gibraltar. 
You guys go ahead. And you guys are hanging out. Um, pretty much. Census in the British Isles. Yes. What else? Sink everything they've freaking got around here. That's nice. 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 Ah, oh, good. You only need one guy to go there. And then you'll need uh, maybe a single guy to go from here to uh, here. And then you might need uh, this guy. The Alaskan Defense Command go from here to uh, like there. Go when you can. And you guys go from here to there. That'd be fantastic. Maturian War of Independence, nice. And the Belgians finally died. How are we doing down here? Doing okay? I just kill them off. Basic medium tanks, it's fine. Um, help our guys out a little bit. That. Oh god, dang it. No, I don't want these stupid things. There you go. Stop it. Stop it. Ah. More marines? Sure, why not? Oh, good god. It's really gonna suck fighting down here, isn't it? French commune, eh? Hey, we got in there. That's good. Something's going on all around the place here, and it's almost... Not quite 41. Alright, get bull got that, we'll be fine. Top red. So, there's the convoys here and there. You know what, let's reverse this. You guys come here to Gibraltar. You guys go up here. Definitely gonna need that. Come on. You already took all these freaking places anyways. There you go. Nice. Fall of Warsaw. Well, that's not good. There you go. And uh, Federal Housing Act. As part of ongoing efforts to eradicate poverty in the United States, we'll create a program of federally subsidized housing. Why not? Yeah, medium tanks. Well, get rid of those guys right there. Columbia is gone. Thank you. Thank you. We'll take all of that. You guys are what? Fascists. Which means we will probably need to kill you off too. Even though I really need to send guys to Europe. Very good. From here to there. And you guys from here to there. Good luck. You might need it. How's China looking? They're actually doing really well. Wow. Um, more divisions, nice. Hopefully they don't get sunk. You help out get down there faster? That'd be great. Cool. I'll end them in just yet. Nice. Four destroyers are sunk. Good. Very good. Critical weakness in shipbuilding over there. Alright, well. Screw it. You can build a craft on a ship, son. Finland's gone. And so are these guys. Good. Porto, Spain. Good. Federal Housing Act, National Employment Strategy. Unemployment comes from a simple fact. People don't match up with the job offered. Factories lie idle because the employers don't find the people they need while people in other parts of the country are starved. We'll introduce a new strategy that will ensure that any employer can find the people he needs to run his company. Why not? Cool. Alright. There you go. 
Don't need access, it's fine. We'll get all the way through here. That'll be fine. And then we can really start focusing on Europe. Because I really want to focus on Europe. Uh, that's fine. We should have enough up there. These guys are just butchering each other right now, which is actually really good for us. So That's all I care about. Lisbon's been captured. Pretty good. Or, or no justification for Lisbon, I should say. Get over there first. And... Ooh... You guys are definitely call those guys into war, aren't they? Can we actually do this? I'll just go right here. That too also works. Polish People's Republic, nice. Go all the way through. Better artillery is nice. Go do that, do that. Thank you very much. You'll be fine. Uh, put anti air and get another left. There we go. As you guys are that. Right. Subs, huh? Mm, damage, dust, defense. There you go. Start rating everything. And there goes Venezuela. Very nice. Not wrong, not bad. Uh, don't get as part of Spain though. Convoys. Ooh. FMGs, huh? Maybe we need spare planes? Fighters go there. Fighters go there. Naval bombers? No, we don't. That kind of sucks. Better radar. Mm. Oh, two. We're lost. National plan strategy and uh, disaggregate the armed forces. Serving under arms, the armed force of one country is not only the greatest duty, but also a cherished right. A right that many of our citizens are denied on account of their ancestry. Oh boy. Let's go over with fire. You can also go over with fire, too. Alright, you wanted it, too? Alright, that's not right. Hey. That. Have mission efficiency. Cool. Alright, let's go. Oh, we have a truce, we can't justify until 41, so it's fine. We'll get over here. Reintegration campaign. Let's go in. Who cares? Literally, who cares? You guys are over here doing that. You guys are going to hold the line. And we'll go to Gibraltar in a little bit. American China, that's perfect. They're doing a fantastic job. Oh, we lost an early sub hole, but whatever. We should probably get some subs. Subs are nice. Takes quite a while to get them, though. That's right. Nice. So you guys get over here too. What's this? Nope. I don't care about Turkey. A afar. What the heck is a far? Rubber Reserve Company, with the eruption of war, we've almost lost all of our sources of imported rubber. With an enormous coordinated effort, there are rubber companies in the United States can cooperate to find better means of producing synthetic rubber, possibly even meeting the demand of the war effort. Why not? Almost 41. Grab that. Oh, yeah. Finally destroy everything they got. Oh, hello. Find their subbies and their chubbies and kill them all off. Hey, not bad. Free Canadian Republic. Uh, well, no. Too bad. Oh, they have guys up here too. That's not good. Anti-air upgrade. Oh, look at this. Oh, well, some five destroy still. That's good. At least that's good. Your last domestic film industry, sure. Mission accomplished. Expand towns. It's not a bad idea. Execute Warplan Purple. 
cannons. Uh, there you go. That was that one. The destroyers are gone. Good. You guys have done a fantastic job. Uh, hello. Awesome. Uh, you guys are down here too. We're just gonna go up this way then. And you guys will go from there. Reserve reserves. Um. I don't know, Confederate war heroes. As misguided of a cause as the Confederacy was, cannot be ignored that the soldiers who fought on his behalf had just as much valor as the soldiers of the Union. They should be remembered as the heroes of the war they were, not the followers of a misguided cause. Followed up with what? Strategic interests. The world is more connected than ever before. A threat of one part of it can easily grow until it becomes a danger to the entire world. We must build a network of mutually supporting bases around the globe to enable us to respond to any transgressions or anything like that. Oh my god, that's a lot of access to kill. The Axis is slowly pushing into the Soviet Union, which is fine with us, we don't really care. But still. Are you guys there yet? Come on. Oh, I definitely come into the war. Justify ten days. It's all right. Oh boy, that's not good. Oh, we found the Japanese fleet. What the heck? Got him the first time, but whatever. To Gibraltar we go. Nice. As you can see, we definitely need some more rubber. Partial mobilization. Ah, go to war economy. It's fine. So how's the war in China going then? It's going quite well. The Soviets are doing well against them, but uh, Soviets are losing to the Germans. So, um, strategic interests. Interests, interests, interests. Good. Good for wrapping them up. I'm just going to let you guys move on over here. Next, the Army of Africa. Not a sea wolf yet. Uh, consumer? Yeah, consumer would be good. Yeah, that was good too. Nice. Torpedo threes. This is going to be a killer sub. Are we getting any other subs? No? Alright, well, do that then. That is some good stuff right there. Destruction, rubber. My god. We're going to need some of that rubber. Hello. Firefighting drills, nice. Go and spend the naval XP, we've got it for reasons like this. Engine 3, engine 40s, that would help. Ground uh, support, yes. Purple. Yeah. Silver Reconciliation Day. More war sport, that's not bad. Why not? 
Intervention mandate? You more war sport. Let's demand stuff from they they refuse. They they were warned, they said not to hear the warning. Okay then, well whatever. Okay, we still have convoys over there, that's good. Sign for more. There we go. Uh protect South America. The South American part of uh, the Dark Double Continent has been the playground of empire since it was discovered. It's time that someone took it upon themselves to ensure that those nations are undisturbed and guided towards a more productive future. Of course. Alright, what do you guys have? Been in the mainland, good. Uh, I'd like to kill these guys off too. I don't trust Canada by doing that, so. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. I need you guys to stay here and literally just hold. Hold the line. Pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. You guys are fine. You guys are making it over there. Yeah, you guys are pretty much already over there. Nice. You guys are hanging out. Sierra Leone is gone. Very surprised the Italians are not being called in. The Swiss are holding out quite well, actually. French commune? Sure. So, how are the Soviets doing? 23 million manpower, 1 million manpower. Opportunity 24 divisions. Uh, that is the AI we're talking about. And Lithuania, or Livonia, I guess, technically, is just kind of like, kind of just hanging out, man. Just kind of chilling. There we go. American China. Barundi. Oh, wow. They went all insane, didn't they? Um, do that, do that, do that. I'll build some infrastructure here and there. I don't know. Qing China's. I love the goddamn place. Are they for the Axis or their French alliance? Fall of Kiev? Oh boy. Well. They immediately start attacking them. That's not the smartest decision, probably. In some areas, they'll do very well. In some areas, they definitely will not. You can try to help out. Nice. Um, it is mountains for a region. Or, for a reason. Follow Gibraltar. That's good. Significant development. And then we're going right there, too. Well, let's not go there just yet. Good. Going through there. That's very nice. Uh, we'll grab some of this next. The land options are very good as well. What's we got going here? Toter. We have two of Toter Toters. Okay, that's weird. Um, you need more rubber. Just tons of rubber, man. Minus 23 is not ideal. What else can we grab here? More consumer goods? Eventually, it's not going to really matter too much. Refinery and. Re Ooh, that might, that might be bad. This would not be bad either. Grab them for now. Sword efficiency? I kind of like that. Let's go with that. Makes the plans even more. Even better, better, better. War Department. In age of industrialized warfare, we must have an administration capable of uh, harnessing the resources of a great nation to their fullest potential. They reject. The delegation from Paraguay and several other groups have hurriedly left the summit to travel home. The Paraguayan ambassador has so far refused to comment on the time, claiming this will be waiting on instructions from home. Okay, that's sad. Australia joins the comment. Okay, then. Uh, are you in the war? You're not in the war, are you? Representatives from off infrastructure for Florida. Nice. All right. Well, Florida, you want up uh, one? Oh, you already maxed out. Well, we'll just bump you up then. There we go. Oh, there goes Norway. That was fast. All right then. Forty-one. Uh, let's see. Here.
Cure on him for now. It's fine. Just hold for the lines. Hold for the lines. Hold, hold, hold. We definitely do not have enough divisions up there just yet. Oh, are you freaking kidding me, boy? Well, y'all better hurry the heck up there. What was that? Nice. Book here's looking a little thick. Soviet Union still ain't doing that well, though. Soviet boys. How's the UK doing? Or Britain? Well, we'll see after this. Stay up for Central American states. The Central America recently incorporated into the Union. It's only fair that the people gain representation. Some have criticized skipping the formalities and granting standards so quickly, but it's for the best in the long term picture. It really is. Nice. Okay, you guys are done. Italian North Africa, Italian Union, whatever. Um, I'm gonna send you guys up here. Uh, you guys go here. Extraction, rubber. God dang it, National Spain. Mauritania, watch out. Avoiding Indiana for some reason, not sure why, whatever. Uh, Bruce Small Airframe, that's good. I don't think we can end the war that fast where we can just not make planes, so. Give me some time and we'll see where we're at. And so after uh, creating all them planes, uh, we're doing alright. We're doing okay. Uh, well, most of us are. Germany's not doing okay. And that's what matters, really. Uh, we're gonna be losing a couple subs because I put some subs through here in the channel, which probably is not a smart idea. But Germany really... Duh, I'm not sure what's going on with them. But as you can see, they ain't got a lot of divisions on the front here. Kind of an issue for them, really. Yeah, get some more. Well, I'll do that much. You still get you some stuff here. Stuff like that, floating harbors, if we have extra spares, sure, why not? I mean, the German Reich has lost quite a bit. We lost less about 100,000. We killed off 400,000 Germans-ish. Destroyed 400,000 Brits, which is pretty decent. Um, so, we just keep making more. More stuff. More subs, more convoys, more everything left like that. Um, probably could use some more, well, refineries, but we're working on it. Only negative 72 stuff here, so it kind of sucks. But whatever. Try that, you know. And get more rubber, that'd be great. What is this third one? Tactical bombers. I have no naval bombers. That's an issue. But, uh, Germany should capitulate us. Should. Um, this extra guy go down there. He should be around here, yeah. Struggling quite a bit because his supplies just so got freaking awful. Um, there you go. And uh, making sure promising young officers get the best military education they can. It's crucial making sure our military is led by the best of the best in the future generation. Two Oceans Navy Act. With the war on the horizon, we must ensure that no enemy can ever set foot on American so shores. Our Navy must be able to fight any enemy in either of the two great oceans that form our borders. Pretty much. Nice. Hello. Fall of Berlin? Nice. So I thought, National Spain. Got a whole another freaking army here. George's patent. Eh, I don't know about patent. Let's go with patch. Go to old patchy patch. They shouldn't be able to do too much against us, seeing as they don't have very much in terms of uh. Oh, look at that noise. Um, fuel. They really don't have any fuel left. Total artillery is fine. Pre naval bombers, yeah. Need quite a bit more. There we go. Cool. Naval department and fuel. There we go. Prevent air. Some more of that. Agent captured. Not good, but Germany should die soon. 
Guys, I want to throw on this. Even more soft attack if possible. So, we take out most of Germany. Select a training act. The United States has historically been uh, <clears throat> slow to adopt drafting in times of war. We're no longer able to afford this luxury. Yeah, that goes pretty good. Thank God. Hello. Certain democratic, whatever. Not really sure how much more the Germans can really hold out. We keep grinding them down. They're out of infantry equipment. They've got almost no artillery left. Hmm. Interesting. Good. Still not a sea wolf, huh? Taking forever. Just in case. Add extra five, even though we still need a little more rubber, but that's pretty normal. It's 42, grab that. We're doing all right. Towns never joined the war effort, which is a little strange, but whatever. Ah, look at this dividing point in Austria. The Soviets, even though we're, we are pushing like crazy into Germany, and they're literally about to capitulate, it means nothing, apparently. Do we not have naval bombers at all? Naval bombers. 69. We have 72 now. There. After that one, we're playing beige. Louisiana maneuvers, probably don't need that. Um, Spore Rock Island, I'm sporting our brave bulk troops in any ways we can is key to victory. Be that by laying down heavy artillery fire from a distance or more direct support on the battlefield, we must make sure our troops have everything they need. Pretty much. Hey, another good German, German Reich. Thank God. Come on, get rid of that. Looking decent. I gotta take out the Hungarians. You're welcome, Soviet Union. You are more than welcome. Well, there you go. Oh god, I've actually lost quite a few ships here, that's not good. All I need is the minion, huh? No, oh, I don't know about that. There you go. So the Union's doing stuff, whatever. Um, yeah. Do that, but not really. Let's Rock Island, which I've read before. If you want to read about uh, tank experiments, please go ahead too. Nice. Finally became a sea wolf. And we'll go with subs. Because that's what I love. Nope. What? Where is the? Oh, come on! Stupid division. I'm here to Dover. Should be pretty easy. And this will make it five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Extra force right there. At the very least, for this campaign, let us 
uh, try to capitulate the Brits. I don't feel like taking out Japan. Artillery. Sure, everybody. Sure, I mean, they've tried to invade and they have been successful, but then they were eventually pushed out. Chinese are doing quite well. Let's interact the General Lee Memorial. Nothing like General Lee. Good, as they should. Um, we got plenty of stuff there. Gas is always nice. We got plenty of steel for more guns. Why not? Nice. Good. Now we're going to need some naval supremacy. Oh boy. Oh boy. If you're about built on the Pentagon, please go ahead too. Very nice. We can get naval supremacy. Get my planes. Give you money to help out here, y'all. Air supremacy. It's fine. They have no fuel. They're gonna lose their ships anyways. So that should help out. And what else? Forty-four percent of the way there, almost. You know what we could do? There's some radar here, right here. That'll help him out. There we go, too. What the heck? Hello. And we're going. Oh, they all died. There you go. Spread out like cancer. Ah. Building the Pentagon, and how about some Department of Defense? There you go. Spreading out like cancer. No when in doubt, the rubber is going to win out. Oh, God. If the Union of Italy really want to join the war against us, like, what the heck, man? Like, bro. Seriously? Are they by themselves? Yeah, they're by themselves. The United Socialist Front. What the heck? God dang it. Bunch of weirdos. Glad we left some division still there on the continent, but my god, what the heck. Nice, there you go. There you go. Nice. Let the guys over here mostly take care of it. That's so stupid. Whatever. Once we get Newcastle, it'll probably be mostly over. Yeah, see. Mostly over. Nice. So I might just end it there. I really don't feel like taking another Japanese. That just takes so freaking long, and it's going to be a messy piece deal, especially between us and the Soviets, and the Italians are being weird. But well, they're Italian, what do you expect? Honestly, the, none of these guys would be able to really fight us, and we really want to, we could probably kill them all off. But I think I'll end it there. If you enjoyed the, the shortish campaign ish, uh, I'll consider leaving a like. Sub, uh, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below if you haven't already, and I'll see you tomorrow uh, in another campaign. Please let me know what you think of this mod uh, that makes America super strong. Thanks for watching. Have a great, tremendous rest of your day.